loading the valve. Advance the tapered outflow tube over the catheter. Gently squeeze the outflow part of the frame. Insert the outflow part of the frame into the outflow cone. Continue to slowly insert the frame into the outflow cone. Make sure that the frame is completely within the outflow cone. Secure the outflow cap to the outflow cone. Insert the non-tapered inflow tube. Continue to advance the inflow tube until the frame tabs expand. Insert the catheter tip distal end through the outflow aspect. Attach the frame loops to the tabs on the catheter deployment end. Cover the frame loops with the catheter sheath by using the micro adjustment knob on the handpiece. Check that all the frame tips are securely covered inside the sheath. Simultaneously advance the tapered outflow tube and catheter sheath over the frame. Remove the outflow cap and inflow tube. Slide the outflow cone over the outflow tube and catheter. Slide and advance the inflow cone over the inflow end of the frame until it touches the outflow tube. Slowly continue loading the valve by using the micro knob on the handpiece. Remove the inflow cone. Before completing the loading process, attach a 10 milliliter syringe filled with sterile saline to the lure connector on the handpiece and flush. Flush the guide wire lumen on the proximal end of the delivery catheter. Continue to load the valve, carefully using the micro knob and outflow tube. Continue the loading process by advancing the catheter sheath. Before using the catheter, remove the outflow tube and outflow cone. The core valve revalving system is now ready to be used.